How to replace a laptop screen for the Lenovo Y50. Things you'll need. Credit card, small screwdriver, and of course, the brand new laptop screen. Yeah. Here's the old laptop. Uh, so we use a credit card here and we slide it right underneath the bezel and you should hear some small clicks and as you slide it along it should easily snap off you can do it gently just make sure you don't bend the plastic too far and put too much force in it or else these pins can break you have to go all the way around the perimeter of this bevel Uh, a lot of other laptops have a similar setup to this, so uh, if you're not using exactly this laptop, this is still a pretty good strategy to approach. It's pretty universal for these kind of screens. There it goes. Alright, so in these uh, top four corners, you're going to need your Phillips uh, screwdriver there. And uh, you want to unscrew each one of these tiny little screws the corner of the LCD or uh, LED screen of this laptop. Be sure to keep in mind uh, where your screen is so it doesn't tip or fall out. Keep track of where you put your screws. You'll need them later. And one more. Now it should easily lift out. You want to place this on the keyboard gently because there's a cable connecting on the back. Don't just pull it out. So there's a bit of protective tape here. You can peel that off. And then the cable right there will disconnect with a motion uh, parallel to its connection. There it goes. So let's switch out the panels for the new one. There it is. I still got the protective film on it. I'm going to remove that last before I put the bevel on to keep it clean. So you want to connect this uh, back the same way you disconnected it. Really gently. Make sure everything lines up cleanly. And you should hear small pins clicking when you get it just right. And you can put the uh, protective tape right back onto it. It just keeps things secure. Just in case it uh, gets jostled around a little bit. Yeah, looks good. Then you can uh, set the screen back in place. And you take those screws you just had before, put them right back in. You can remove the uh, protective film now. Uh, there's still a little bit of tape there, but it won't be uh, apparent when the bevel is back on top. There's a third screw. Uh, don't don't screw these in too tightly. The threading is pretty shallow. You can over uh, over tighten these, so a gentle touch is best. There you go. Make sure it's nice and secure. Now we take that bevel we just took off, and we place it back on. Start with the base. Make sure that lines up cleanly, and start pressing it in until you hear the snaps. Don't force anything. It should all come in quite naturally. Um, if it doesn't fit, don't just push it in. Try unsnapping it and re-snapping it. That's their, your best bet there. Like, see, there's one I missed. And I'm just going to get it just a little bit. There you go. You can turn on the laptop. Make sure power's on. Looks good. Voila.
Your new screen's in there. Looks great. Thank you. What?